All right, I think I am about done here very soon, but uh, let me show you what I've done so far. I haven't really done any, actually I haven't done anything outside and that's a guest. Um, but as you can see, there's now a door here and I think I will go to the nether fortress, get some coal from a wither skeleton so we can make some uh, soul fire torches, is that what they're called? I can't remember. But either way, I made this. And I just think it looks pretty awesome. Like with this like border that goes down and around here with these like chiseled in here. I think that looks pretty cool. I hope this will be able to be orientated um, eventually. I really hope so. Uh, so I'm kind of counting on that. Um, and I first thought of putting the door here. But I feel like it just closes this like impressive tunnel off when coming like from the outside. Looking at this mysterious tunnel thing. So... I feel like leaving it like that, but then again, I do kind of want the door. Even though piglins, at least I think piglins and pigmen can just walk in through the doors. At least piglins can, I think. Um, and it can at least maybe block out, I don't know. Yeah, since it is Crimson Forest, we might get hocklins and stuff. Let me know if you have any idea for a door thing maybe there. I don't know. But yeah, let me know what you think. Here, on the other hand, I am still thinking what to put into here. I mean, I'll need some storage somehow. Alright, so far I think I'm happy with this. Have some furnaces over here. We have some, uh, well, a double chest right here. And I guess we can maybe put a crafting table somewhere or just leave it here. I don't know. <laughs> and we have the tunnel here. I'm going to go over to the fortress to get some coal in a second. But I was actually on my way over there and then realized that there's a complete drop. So I gotta figure out a way of, well, having like a platform thing over here that I can walk on. And that actually leads up to like the base. So yeah, I don't know about that. I'm thinking like literally just a basalt platform that goes out a little bit and maybe goes down like so. I don't know. What just... Oh. You. Invite yourself in, why don't you? Alright, I changed the door a little bit. I turned them so they are the other way around. Buttons still work and everything. I turned the stairs around just so this works a little bit better. Um, now I just gotta get down somehow. I'm thinking something like this. We can potentially put some fence around here. Actually, speaking of which, I think that will look better. Um, maybe put some fence. Ooh, some of the new fence. Ooh, that is a... Ooh, wee! This is... <laughs> this is a perfect opportunity to actually uh, implement or use um, the new fence that has been added. I don't remember. Okay, we got blackstone wall. We got polished blackstone wall, I'm pretty sure. Uh, yep, we got black, polished blackstone wall. We also got the, um, let me see, there we go. We also got these walls. Um, even better though would be, because all of this stuff is pretty dark, it would be cool to use, well, we can we make walls of that actually? All right, turns out you cannot. So I just made one of each uh, of these walls here, and I think it has to be either this one or this one this is just a normal blackstone uh, wall which I mean it looks good but since we have the stairs and such here I just feel like it matches a lot better with the bricks since that is what the bricks are made of so I think we're gonna go with the polished one actually I just feel like that is gonna look yeah a lot better I don't I don't think the other one is gonna look as good all right I think something like that would do we can still go out here look at the view and we don't risk falling off when we get out of our door here. We could also add, I suppose, something like here. And then maybe block off this section. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Something like that. I think that is going to look pretty cool. Mm, maybe not the last one there. I just don't want uh, a free one here because then you can actually walk like that. So I kind of want that blocked off. Um, but it's still enough so we can look. And yeah, I think this is actually not too bad. I guess we could put one here, but eh, I think it's fine. Then we have this blocked off here, and then we can have this being a ladder, which I need to make. There we go, ladder has been installed. 
And now I think we all we need to do is to maybe make this bit, this this place a little bit more flat and open, so I can actually get here a little bit easier. So I think something like this, and then maybe not have a lava pool right next door uh, to fall into. I don't know. I think this is good. I think I like this. There's actually lava right below here, so yeah, don't wanna. I don't want to fall down in that, and I s suppose making a staircase down here eventually will work. But, like, I'm probably gonna come from, like, over here from the right most of the time, I suppose. So maybe just having this a little bit more flat like that is gonna be uh, just a little bit more welcoming. And, uh, just gonna block this off. And let me go and get some coal for some torches, because that's gonna make this look a lot nicer when there's actually light here so let me do that hopefully without dying because I can hear a blaze and I'll be right back and I think we're gonna call it an episode yeah I think this is gonna look nice maybe add a support beam right there maybe add a support beam right there does this fit? ah this doesn't fit I might actually make it make it fit with this so it looks like this goes all the way up uh, and supports it yeah I guess we could just do it right here How's that gonna look? Maybe just get rid of that then, and put that. And maybe one more over here as well. Uh, yep, just get rid of that, build up all the way. Do what you do do. Something like so. Yep, that'll work. I think that'll work, and then it's like coming up from the wall like so. I think that's not too bad. I've gotta get this chest up as well, but for now, Time to get some coal. Yep. I think I might decorate this place a little bit more though. I'm not sure. I feel like I want to add some sort of decoration stuff. But I don't know what. And I suppose I need maybe a stair down here. Yeah, I'll work on something. I'll be right back. Alright, I think that I am done with this construction work for now at least. Um, I think we're at a place, at a point where I'm okay happy with it. So I think we're gonna leave it at this. So how about we start from the bottom and work our way up and take a look at it. So, first off we have the bottom here looking pretty, pretty good. I wish the stairs there were made with like the quad bricks, but I guess, I don't know if we will ever get that, hopefully just so it would fit better, I don't know. But it, it looks pretty good. And then we, of course we have the other platform here, made with a polished basalt. And we have made a, or I made a staircase here, um, leading up with some, some chiseled black stone here, and just made a little bit of a floor. This chest and crafting table will be removed, and we have a ladder going up here, like so. And up here, of course, we have the fence, and this is where I wanted to put some torches up just to give a little bit of light here and make this place look a little bit nicer maybe add one back here somewhere maybe back here yeah cool something like that to light the place up a bit a bit a bit <laughs> um i guess we could actually remove this entire thing hmm that would make actually even more room huh maybe i don't have my basalt here come on Get, get back here. Do I even have any? There we go. <laughs> get this and put it... I, I suppose that would make sense. Yep, cool. Um, so this is the outside and then we head inside and in here we also need to place some lighting. But other than that, I think we are good. So we have the window here looking pretty good. Uh, just doing some cleanup work as well. Get rid of that and rid of this as well. Sweet. So we have the door there, and we have a window here, we have the window here where we can look out through... Well, bleh, bleh, can't speak anymore. We can look out the battle deltas, and we can even see a little bit of the fortress there. We have the floor, we have a chest here, and we have some furnaces, and that will be a nice thing if we do get stairs in these uh, quartz bricks. We could actually make a stair here, and we would have be able to have another chest up here, so hopefully that is going to be a thing in the future. I'm just going to place a crafting table right there and just make another one just so it looks cool. Like that. 
I don't know what I should put up here, if anything. Maybe just more foreign furnaces. I don't know. But then over here, of course, we have the tunnel or a little, yeah, tunnel. I don't know what to call this. Hey, buddy. <laughs> a little bit of a tunnel here and a uh, gate tunnel entrance here. Looking pretty cool, I think, and a little bit of a path. And I think this place looks pretty cool. So, yeah, guys, I think that will be it for this episode. Don't you dare get close here. I'm going to head inside. But yeah, I think that is going to be it for this episode. We used a lot of the new blocks um, and even the torches here, which is really cool. I don't want torches in here. I want that to be kind of like dark and mysterious. Maybe if we had a torch there. Yeah, that lights the place up nice. All right, cool. I'm going to clean up my inventory and stuff. And yeah, I'm going to call it an episode here. I hope you enjoyed and I hope to see you in the next one. Have a wonderful day and goodbye. I gotta collect stuff and actually hold on before we go. Before you go, before we go, we can place an ender chest right here because this will be our forward operating base. So an ender chest right here will be ideal. So that is perfect right there. I'm going to clean up my inventory, transfer stuff from the chest down here and uh, yeah. All right. So I am just coming in here after the clip that you have just seen. Um, Actually, after uploading the first part, um, I just wanted to add this because I thought it was a really, really good idea and just to like finish off the build. Because some of you in the comments in the part one video uh, said that trap doors would be a great way to use the windows. And I must say I agree. So yeah, that actually these we, I suppose we could put these on the side. No, you can't put them on the side. Never mind. I wanted to put them on the, at the side. Ow! Like a door, but okay, fine, fine. Dip, 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 dip. There we go. <laughs> now, should they turn outwards or inwards on the big one here? I am not sure. Because, hmm. If they face this way, it's going to look better from the inside. But on the outside, it's going to look more flush. So I'm not sure. I think I'm just going to. Hmm. 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 Because also, if we put them like that, it's going to be very, very flush. And we can't really see out. Yeah, I think we're going to turn them the other way just so it's easier to look out. So just going to add them like so. Boom, 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 boom. And windows. And a pretty big one. And we even have an emergency uh, emergency escape route. <laughs> and we can open the windows too. So that's cool. Good suggestion, guys, for those of you that suggested that. And uh, yeah, I'll see you in the next one. By the way, the new snapshot has come out. And I'm looking forward to it. Much hype. See you in the next episode. Yeah.